Well, it's 11.53, and if you suffer from migraines, my sister-in-law gets them. I always feel so bad for her. It's like the pain literally stops you in your tracks. Yes, it does. And our next guest is a plastic surgeon at University Hospitals. Dr. Baman Gairon is here to talk about how he can offer some relief. Doctor, thank you so much for coming on thank the show. You. Hi, doctor. Before we get Hi. to the study, how common are research studies done on migraines, and how often are these new techniques used? We have dis disseminated information across the world and the surgery is being done very frequently and a lot of centers are doing uh, studies now. In fact, there are three other international centers that have proven that what we're doing is effective. It works. Hmm. You're currently enrolling patients in some study. Why don't we yes. talk about this? Because I'm sure there's a lot of you out there that are suffering from migraines that yes. think, hmm, I'd love to learn more. Yes, actually, this is part of our crusade to make the patients uh, pain-free, yeah. and we're trying to improve our results. Migraine headaches are uh, like carpal tunnel. People, I'm sure you know what that is. Sure. It's a painful condition. What we do is decompress the nerves, and it has components. And what we, we are trying to do is to see how we can simplify the procedure and improve our results and get more success rate. Is it the same procedure for anyone who has a migraine or with the different severities of the migraine you actually use different techniques on them? Yeah, it is not so much as a severity, it is the location that makes the difference as to what we're going to be doing. In fact, some patients have uh, pain in the forehead, some have in the temple, some have in the back of the head and some behind the eye. And I have developed a surgical technique to eliminate each one of those the, uh, migraine trigger sites. Now, are, are there certain requirements, like basic things that are required to become a possible patient for something like this? Yes, obviously this is surgery and the patients uh, must have uh, frequent enough and severe enough migraine pay, uh, headaches mm -hmm. to qualify for the surgery or the study. And the other aspect is they have to be seen by a neurologist and the diagnosis of migraine headaches must have been made by a neurologist. So how can a patient find out if they're eligible to enroll in this? Because obviously there's some cost involved. I mean, there's a number of things that people will have to take into consideration. Yeah, the cost actually is simple. It is going to be either paid by the insurance or we have secured a grant to pay for uh, the patients who do not have, uh, the patient surgery who do not have insurance. And uh, the patients, uh, those who are uh, potentially candidates can call uh, Mary at 440-646-2173. And don't you worry, we're going to be up oh, and see. Yeah. That's, that's how great our crew is. We've yeah. got uh, <laughs> the number up there on the screen. We'll put it up again before we're through talking. But, you know, I thought it was really interesting, doctor, because in the commercial break, I said, wow, this is really interesting to me, plastic surgery for migraines. But you said, I've been doing this for a long time. When did you first start this whole deal? We, I started this about 12 years ago, and actually it was started by the patients telling me that their headaches are going away when we do a forehead rejuvenation. Is that right? And at about the same time, we started seeing Botox working for the migraine headaches. So I put those together and came up with the theory that actually we have validated through, again, many studies over the last 12 years. And Dr. Lastly, we have about 30 seconds, but I'm assuming that your patients who came in with migraines, I know people with them and they just, they're debilitating. Yeah. Dramatically, you had to have changed their lives in a, in a most positive way. Yeah, I'm fortunate enough, fortunate enough to have a lot of satisfied patients, but this is the most gratifying surgery that I do. And anytime the patient tells me that I have changed his or her life, I get a thrill out of it. Well, thank you so That's much pretty. for uh, joining us. And here is that phone number again where you can call Mary. University Hospitals Department of Plastic Surgery, 440-646-2173. Thank you, doctor, and happy thank holidays. Thank you so very much. Uh, thank yes, you. such nice a pleasure nice to meet you. you. Michael, good seeing you Good seeing you too, yes. doctor. All right, we've got more coming oh. up. Oh, he's out of here. He has to go. He's got another surgery. He's got patients. Let's be honest.